Okay, so this is my pillow doll, um, like Marty. Like, like when we were on a um, a power boost, like the so this is what she comes with. Mm. I took off her outfit so that you could see a couple of things. She comes with this cute little underwear and bra. I'll show her outfit stains her a little bit. Um, her stomach is a little tiny bit blue. Her shoulders and her arms and hands. But I was warned that before I got her by French King. Um, and then this is what else she This is her little skirt. And it has little snaps there so that it's easy to get on and off. Um, little snaps. And then it has this little fake little Scottish pin. And then... Let me turn off the TV. Hold on. Hey. Yourself, Munya. See, TV's off. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> There's her box, by the way. Um, then she has this little, like, sweater thing with snaps. And it has little cute little beads on the bottom. And then she comes with this cute little hat. And then I just wanted to show you what she looks like with the hat. What hat? It didn't mess up. Um, this little thing that like goes over her shoulder. I guess it's like I don't know what it's supposed to be, but it goes over her shoulder. Has a little elastic there. And then um, her bagpipes. And I think this goes around her neck. And they're like stuffed. So she can do a lot of stuff. And then her boots. And they're so cute in the socks, but they the socks come out, but they're just in the boots right now. Because I just slid off the boots and the socks out. And then this little, it's like a, a thing that goes around her waist and it has a little bag on it and it's kind of like a belt. And then this little thing, it's like a belt on there and then a little piece that goes around her shoulder. And then, um... One second. Oh yeah, it's right here. She comes with a stand. And it says pull up right there. And they don't fit in the stand very good. It's kind of hard to get them to stand up because it's like slippery. And then I found out how to work her eyes. The eye mechanism is back there. And the switch moves her eyes. Hold on. Hold on. That's not the switch. That's a button. Right here. Switch. Moves her eyes. It's kind of creepy. And she can close her eyes. And I don't know how to keep her eyes closed. Please comment below if you know how to like keep her eyes closed. Because I don't want to like ruin my doll like experimenting with her. Like how to get her eyes closed. Oh, by the way, the underwear and bra come off just so you know. I just didn't want to have her like naked in the video but those are this is the eye mechanism. This switch you just switch it around and it moves her eyes. This button like said I and this button like said I and I don't know how to get her eyes to stay open. I've tried like everything that I could think of that won't ruin my doll if it doesn't work. Um so yeah this is my pull up doll. Um fix her I'm going to show you where she bends, just for, like, future reference, if you don't know what a pull-up doll is like. Um, her neck moves, kind of. Not too much, but it does move. Like that. It doesn't move side to side, just... And then, her hair is very soft, and it kind of feels and looks wet, but it's not. Um, and then, her wrist. They don't bend too easily, but they do bend, and her hands are like rubber. And then her elbows bend, and her shoulders bend on both sides. And then her ankles bend, and her knees. And they don't, they kind of make like a squeaking sound. And her thighs. Oh! That wasn't supposed to happen. Good thing I'm not like high up. That she probably would have her head probably would have fell off. I'm
I'm probably never going to customize it unless I start getting, like, really good at customizing. Like, if I get new stuff on eBay and I start, like, custom just messing around with them and then I get really good at customizing. Probably never going to customize her. But this is, like, her waistband, which I think is kind of cool. So that's basically a pole ball. That's what they work like. They have big heads and small bodies. And they're very tall. Bye.